All right, RK Bro and Drew McIntyre versus the Bloodline in the main event. Oh, Superman punched by Roman Reigns. Thought we were gonna see another Mike Chandler to the mouth. Jay, but Jay Uso sacrificed. A comeback for ref seen that foot kick um, Michael Chandler did on Saturday night at UFC 274 against Tony Ferguson. Okay. It's a six-man tag. It's what they're supposed to do. Look out for their family. Look out for their team. And now McIntyre in trouble as Reigns assaults the. Scottish warrior. Reigns in control. Oh, and Roman with a kick. You see the strut of Roman Reigns. This is when he goes into God mode here. A little bit pissed, certainly confident. Uh, slows the pace down to where he wants it. Orton and Riddle both up on the apron. Orton finally recovered from the super kick he ate. There to see Jimmy Uso a few moments ago. McIntyre now being battered by Reigns. Look at Roman go. It's a buzzsaw of rights. And Reigns off the ropes, and down goes McIntyre. That's why he's champion. The swagger, the skill. The yeah, swagger. remind me. <laughs> Roman Reigns taking in both of them. Taking in both titles. And, and just lifting them up in the middle of the match, man. The undisputed WWE Universal Champion, arguably Corey, one of the greatest champions of all time. You will get no argument from me or anybody with a brain. In the middle of the match, flexing and posing with both of his titles. Oh, oh, oh Rob! <laughs> with a cheap shot to Riddle, he just ticked Orton off. <sighs> oh, a claymore by McIntyre! So yeah, when Orton hit, oh! One, two, oh my God! Jay Uso brace it up, man. But that crowd erupted when Randy here on with that RKO, man. For the entire bloodline, after the Viper went all in on the RKO, I still can't believe the RKO to Reigns, quite literally beating Superman to the punch, and now McIntyre. Who's fired up after a claymore to Reigns earlier? Beating down Jay. Throwing him across the ring. Another one! Yeah, but this time he's got time to set it up and deliver with impact. Oh, and he oh super kick from character. Jay! Jay Uso a step ahead of the Scottish Warrior. Double super kick. Double super kick. There are bodies strewn everywhere. Jay Uso, the only one resembling any sort of upright position. Well, until Riddle finds his footing on the apron. Riddle wants 
to tag Randy Orton, a legal man. Orton in need of a tag. And look at smart move by Jey Uso. Dragging Jimmy, his brother, to the corner to make a tag. Now Riddle. And Jimmy, Riddle tags in. Jey Uso tags in. And Riddle. Stunning Jay. He didn't kill up his own. Roman Reigns trying to get in the ring, got caught. And Riddle now, looking to put this match up away. There goes Jimmy. Jimmy. Missed with that one. Oh, it didn't miss. Oh, nice. Proton connects. Oh, the running knee, the flat knee that time by Riddle. Proton into a oh. suplex. Riddle's running through the bloodline. Oh. Loaded, bro. This one away. You got him. For the win. For Riddle. Hook of the line. One, Is it two. Kick out? Oh, kick out by Jey Uso. Unbelievable. What a match. What a disbelief on the face of Riddle. Let's watch this. The floating blow connects. But upon impact, it turned Jey Uso, which unintentionally may have preserved this matchup for the bloodline. That extra hiccup. You're 100% right, Universe. And now Riddle going to the place that Randy Orton goes to. A little homage to his friend, the Viper. No! Channels him up. One, two. Kick out at two. Go. Oh, nice Got Am I doing it? Pop up that breaker by Jay. And Randy Orton this time breaks it up. And now Jimmy back in. Taking a look at that pop-up neck breaker here. Lance Governs and Ribbon down. Hit absolutely on the money. And now Orton outside the ring. And he's driving oh. Jimmy Uso all over the place. The Viper's on a rampage. Uppercut after uppercut by Orton. And he just saved Riddle. Now he's looking to take out Jimmy. The intensity of and Roman Oh, Roman Reigns with a Superman punch. That's the earlier. Reigns with payback after the RKO. And now Drew McIntyre sending Reigns into the steps. The hell is Drew McIntyre looking at or thinking? No, I don't like to look I at his face. I don't know what Drew's thinking, but let's get the hell out of the way. With a clear the, uh, the announce table, Drew McIntyre sending stuff flying. My pencil's gone. You haven't taken a note since you worked here. And now Drew McIntyre. We expected chaos, panic, and disorder. And McIntyre going to deliver. Now from behind, Jimmy Uso. Glasgow Kiss. Helping his cousin Reigns. And Reigns now. Oh, rock bottom through the table. like a moonsault, tope, all from Jey Uso. Randy to the right of me, Scottish Warrior to the left. And we're stuck in the middle again. Oh, oh look at this. Bang. Uso caught him with a kick. Knee strike from Riddle. Super Uso. kick from, from Uso. Main event, Jey Uso. What a match. Jey Uso super kicking anything and everything that moved. Uso with an opportunity now to seal the deal for his family. Jey Uso going up top, going to look for the Uso splash to put this one away. Riddle meets him. Wake right up, Chad Riddle. Oh, I can't go from the top rope. Roman, spear to Riddle. He got him. He got him. one, two, three. What a man of man.
What a main event, man. That was an excellent main event. That was a great main event. I enjoyed it. Um, this entire show overall, it was pretty solid. It was not a bad show. Um, other than the Bobby Lashley Omos match and the Happy Corbin Madcap Moss match, this show was pretty, pretty enjoyable. It was pretty solid. Um, nothing too crazy. So yeah, man, just a solid pay per view. So, solid pay per view from WWE. Now we move on to Hell in a Cell, which is on June fifth, and they're emanating from Chicago. So let's see what happens. But yeah, man. Um, I I got a gut feeling, man. We're seeing the end of the Bloodline coming soon. You know, Roman Reigns. A video came out and it surfaced around. All over social media saying how Roman Reigns is entering a new phase of his career pretty soon. And they were in Trinity, New Jersey. And, you know, how he Roman was teasing going to Hollywood. So WWE needs to find someone quick. Um, I, you know, I asked myself, how, how, how is they going to book Roman consistently for, for, for a year straight? For another year straight, but... Looks like we're seeing the end of the bloodline coming coming soon, man. I don't know who the Usos are gonna drop those titles to, but I gotta get I got a good feeling it's coming soon that the Usos will drop those titles. It's coming soon. Um, and then Cody Rose will take down Roman Reigns for the WWE title, and then Drew McIntyre. I think Drew, even though we didn't advocate for it, it looks like Drew McIntyre will be the guy to take down. Take down Roman Reigns for the for the Universal Championship on the SmackDown side. So it looks like Cody Rhodes and Drew McIntyre will be the guys to take down Roman Reigns for their separate titles, and that way Raw would get the World Championship back, and then SmackDown can can still keep their World Champion. And since they're not ending the brand split, we will still have two separate World Champions on two separate brands. And for the SmackDown tag team titles, who dethrones the Usos? I honestly don't know, man. I honestly don't know. I there's no tag team division, man. There's no tag team division. Honestly, if I was to choose, who would dethrone them? Hmm. They they ran through everybody. It's very tough, man. But it looks like the end of the bloodline is coming soon. I got a gut feeling it will happen. The end of the bloodline. Um, and then Roman posted an, posted an Instagram video not too long ago saying, you know, this might be the Bloodline's last uh, six man tag team match together. You know, you know, you know, you, you never know. Even more teasing that he's leaving for Hollywood. So WWE better better find someone to to, to take down Roman Reigns, man. And it looks like Drew McIntyre and Cody Rhodes will be the guys to take down Roman Reigns. Um, but WWE needs to build new stars, man. They need to invest in. You know, Austin Theory, Braun Breaker, Carmelo Hayes, Tony D'Angelo, Grayson Waller. Uh, who else? Sol Sokoa. Cameron Grimes. And for the women, you know, they're going to push the same four women. And the four, the same four women, man, they're not going to want to do this anymore. They're not going to want to do this full time. Shasha, it looks like we're, we're about to see the end of Shasha Banks, Shasha Banks' career as well. Cause she's doing more mainstream stuff outside of WWE with the with the TV and the movies and the de and the endorsement deals. It looks like we're about to see the end of Sasha Banks WWE career pretty soon. I got a gut feeling as well that Sasha's time might be up. So you need to invest in Toxic Attraction. You need to invest in Roxanne Perez, Roxy. You need to invest in you, you got Nikita Nikita Lyons coming up. And I and I'm dragging this out a little bit, but I'll throw in Corey J's name in that in that list. Io Shirai, Kaylee Ray. Cause you really haven't you really haven't built any new stars lately. Except for Bianca Belair. You haven't really built any new stars. So yeah. And maybe maybe Rhea Ripley. I'm dragging this out, but maybe Rhea Ripley. So you really haven't haven't built anybody new except for Bianca and Rhea Ripley. But yeah, man. Just 
you better start creating, man. You better start creating new stars before it's too late. Because we already, I'm already sensing the, the end of Sasha Banks' career. Her, her WWE career. Well, after after WrestleMania thir after WrestleMania thirty nine in Hollywood, Shasha's gone and Roman's gone. That those are two names I think that I think that's gonna be gone. And they'll they'll take a part time deal. They'll be back for the big shows like the War Rumble, SummerSlam, WrestleMania. But we're sensing the end of the Bloodline, the end of Roman Reigns' career full time. We're sensing the end of Shasha Banks' career full time. This is it. This is, this is it. WWE needs to create new stars, man. They need to create. But other than that, man, thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed the WrestleMania Backlash reactions. Um, I'll be back back here again in two hours for Monday Night Raw, man. Um, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in a little bit for Monday Night Raw, man. Love y'all. Take care. I'm out.